Hey guys, I'm here to review this game right here. It's called Ice. It's uh, one of those pretty interesting games. Here it is. So we're just gonna get right into it. I won't talk about it till you guys actually see what it's all about. So I just want to give you a preview of what you would actually see on your iPad. Um, some of these games are also available for iPhone, not just iPad. Uh, they're available for iPad Air, iPad Mini, and iPad Retina Display, whichever you have, the fourth or um, the iPad uh, Mini um, Retina Display. Anyways, um, this game is pretty much just looking around, you're supposed to find stuff. And as you can see, it's pretty dark, so you're supposed to concentrate a lot just go, um, it'll tell you what to do exactly so you can just push the door here to open it so we're gonna do that and you're supposed to find bags around and stuff and pick it up um, with the music that's pretty scary, it's like it's like going into a um, horror movie and kinda trying to get things. Anyways, uh, to get through doors you basically just slam into them. Um, as you can see they tried to make it pretty creepy, kind of black and white type of deal. So you could go pretty much anywhere right here. You only have this type of view. It's supposed to get you scared. So I have to say with the sound and everything it, it does get pretty creepy. So I do like that actually about it. Um, some of the stuff you just can't seem to run. I just want to see why I should run. There we go, and that's why we should run. So there we go. Um, we're gonna change the difficulty to hard. I'm gonna put play again. So as you can see, you're not supposed to get caught by ghosts or anything like that in the game. Um, it's just one of those games that you could play at night, and it can potentially be kind of scary for you. Um, you, it pretty much forces you to concentrate quite a bit just because everything's dark and you're supposed to look around okay that's what you're supposed to do it during this game so since everything's dark you can't really see too much ahead of you you do have to concentrate a little bit and every, if anything comes out of your screen that's the tactic of this game plus um, the music is, is pretty much neutral so I'll just get you guys through the game a little bit so you guys can see what it's all about. If maybe this is the type of game that you want on your iPad or iPhone or iPod Touch. So right now I'm, I'm in the hard level. Well this is supposed to be hard just in case. I'm supposed to find the combination. Sure, why not? So I picked up those papers. All I do is tap on them. Uh, same thing here. I see this kind of open. Kind of go over it, tap on it, nothing happens. Same thing here. I mean, for me, it gets kind of boring not that interesting so there's an eye to see so I would say if you see anything shaking like that in this game you're supposed to just run so I'm just gonna click on this eye right here I'm gonna click on that eye right there So you can see pretty much what you can hear is your footsteps. I'm going to turn up the volume a little bit so you guys can hear a little bit more. Tap music. So that's the sound that you hear on here. I'm not going to turn it up too much. So it's telling me to run. So that's what I'm doing. So I'm going to pick these bags up just by stepping on them. And tapping on each one as well. There we go. I don't know if we can pick up the candle. According to this, no. So let's just get out of here.
So I don't know if this this game I would say it's not for everybody. It's uh, an interesting game to have. The graphics are pretty good as you can see. They're not bad at all. Um, they do make it like a horror movie, which I like. I, I I'm a horror movie junkie, so I like that type of stuff. Um, okay. So when you're playing this, you will turn up your volume quite a bit just to hear, and that's the bad and good part. Because you know when you turn up the volume in these games, uh, if they put sound, that's pretty hard. And I mean, you will hear it really, really hard once it comes up. So I'm trying to cover all my spaces. I'm supposed to run. I'm not gonna run just to show you guys what appears if you don't run. So there we go. And that's it, and you're supposed to play again. So that's it for the game. I can't say much, because I don't like it myself. But um, hey, maybe it's your type of game. Maybe it'll be interesting. If you like mysterious type of things, this is the game for you. If you don't, then it's not the game for you. So that's it for this review of Eyes. You'll see if you want it, buy it. If you don't, don't. Um, you can see in this review kind of what you expect to get if you buy this game. Um, me recommend it? Not really. I'm actually going to delete it after making this review, and that's it. These are the games I'm going to make reviews of up next. Um, make sure to subscribe and rate. If you guys have any questions, comments, please write them here below. And don't forget to subscribe and rate. Thank you.